Recently, somebody asked me, he said, you know some stuff about computers. What what should you, would you tell an older person or a child should be their first computer? Well, if you're going to come, my answer to that is, it took me a while to think of it, is look in the toy section, the kid section of uh, Walmart and um, Best Buy and Toys R Us. Toys R Us has a really good selection of uh, durable tablets and um handhelds they're not really a tablet they're kind of small the ones i've seen there not as small as a phone but they're as smaller than a tablet if um, you are going to produce you need a computer screen at least uh, 13 inches if not bigger psychologically some studies have been done and if the computer is um, over 30 13 inches in screen you're 30 percent more likely to um, produce something, actually make videos like this one or anything creative, anything that's making content on the internet, I suggest something bigger than the 13 inch. I've seen some 13.3 inch um, laptops, I mean not laptops, tablets, but I wouldn't recommend those either. Um, they're very difficult to use. You can get a uh, iPhone 4S off of eBay for less than $80. I think the iPads are going for a hundred which those are very easy to use I've had to set up Androids before and the problem I had with those is where you start out like trying to connect to the internet or set the person's account up it took me a long time to figure out that it's not under the heading or the symbol that I thought it would be it's actually the one to the left of it I can't remember what it is I think it was a world instead of the three lines which shows that you're connected which I found that very difficult to use took me a while to figure out setting that up for somebody else's phone and it just seems kind of clunky for some reason the um, Android is just much more difficult to use um, than an iOS system <coughs> so I'd re recommend something Apple even if it's old and used and or something from a kid section so it's durable and it's easy to use it, it takes a while to people I've worked with to get the concepts. It seems to be easier if you're a child because I think you haven't been exposed to, to a system already. Um, older people, uh, I try to relate it back to something that they're familiar with like an actual desktop and files and folders and drawers and that kind of stuff and it doesn't seem to be um, anywhere as near as effective as working with children. But um, That's my two cents. Uh, desktop computers are really high, um, difficult to carry around. Laptops can be upgraded, but you know it's a solid state, which is going to be more expensive. You have to find somebody who knows what they're doing, um, and you can update the RAM, but only so much. So uh, you're probably better off with a tablet. It's lighter. I think you're less likely to break it. The battery life seems to be a lot more than um, laptops recently. And you don't have to carry the, uh, the some people call them a brick, but the um, the uh, transformer, the bit, the block thing that gets hot. Um, the DDR3 gets a lot harder than the DDR2, which is a newer technology. I'm sorry, I think I have those backwards. Anyway, the new Apples and probably most computers from now on don't have a fan, don't have the block, and uh, don't get hot. So there's no chance of them burning you. Uh, if you got the DDR2 um, and they get very hot, those burn out inside, which is I've seen the biggest problem with people's computers. They bring it to me and go, oh, it stopped working. You can actually pull on the cord a little bit, just um, the, the thinner of the two, one coming out of the block, and just barely pull it up and down. And you can hear it if you're wristing closely and hear it crick and kind of pop that means it's shorted out inside there and you need to get another power supply you can get one usually at the store for the ones I've seen about ten to fifteen dollars or if you're willing to wait and order from China it'll take three to four weeks and you can get one for anywhere from three to six dollars I think uh, eBay I think has had the best price but Amazon and some of the others are are you know with within probably fifty cents anyway I hope that you found this uh, video useful Please share it if you did. Please like, subscribe, and leave me a comment below if you'd like to see any more videos, have any more questions answered. Thank you.